The overall goal of this procedure is to outline the surgical steps involved in the implantation of microelectrode arrays for chronic electrophysiologic recording in freely behaving marmosets. Marmosets are small primates that are increasingly being used in neuroscience research. These animals share many of the practical and logistical advantages of rodents. Their propensity for twinning and high fecundity at young ages means ready access to large and genetically similar cohorts. In addition, their small body size makes them easy and relatively cheap to care for. As primates, the marmoset has a central nervous system that is much more similar to the human than that of the rodent. This includes a highly developed prefrontal cortex and visual system. An advantage that marmosets have over many other species of primates, however, is the progress made in genetically modifying them. With a deeply sequenced genome and success generating founder knock-in and knock-out animals, it is clear that the marmoset is poised to become a powerful model for studying brain function in health and disease. A common method for studying brain function involves implanting electrodes in anatomically specific locations. This allows one to chronically record the neural activity in different target areas in awake and freely behaving animals. Prior to the surgery, determine the interaural zero coordinate for all implants and guides. To do so, attach each electrode array that will be implanted to an electrode holder and set one microwire to the interaural zero. This is where the ear bars meet. Repeat this for the additional electrode arrays and holders if necessary. In addition, repeat this with a 24 gauge needle similarly attached to a stereotaxic probe holder. For electrophysiologic arrays, a ground wire should be soldered to every...